jacket that was made by tech speed this biker jacket is top brand leather real leather so it's not any of that fake shit so this biker jacket has armor to protect you from if you fall off your bike if you have a bike if you don't have a bike and you don't like the armor you can take the armor out by just on on it doing some shit so i'm going to show you a few things with this this leather jacket has a belt that you can apply by going like this. Everyone knows how to use a belt. Put it through there. Any size that is that suits you, whichever way, obviously, will do you good. Trust me, it does you good. This is a penny pocket. So if you're ever going to the store or the shop or whatever, wherever you're from, this is a penny pocket. So if you don't want to reach out with your wallet, get your coins or paper out, you can just get your coins out of there. And some people use these for their, if you live in America, you use a gun. If you want to use your gun, you can put it in there. If you have a second amendment right in America. Second amendment, I think I'm saying that right. Some people can use these, this for their phone. It says you can use it for your phone, but some people that I watch use it for their knives, which is fucking cool. Um, yeah. That's pretty much, you can fucking pop your collar if you want, whichever one you want to do. And I'm going to show you some shit on how to put the armor on the inside. So stay tuned for that. Oh sorry, I didn't see you there. Okay, so this is armor for your jacket. It's mostly padding, it's not like steel armor, so it's not going to rip through your back if you fall off your bike. This is padding that will protect your back. It's better protecting your back than actually breaking your back. So this will protect your back. So I forget which way you put this in. It's either way. Either way I reckon because, you know. But I'm just going to put it in this way. So to put this big piece in your back of your jacket. What you have to do is there will be on this particular jacket. Now I'm not saying on every jacket. But this place, Just look at the brand there. It's tech speed. So if you go to Amazon, look up Tech Speed Biker Marlon Brando. Yeah, yeah, Tech Speed Marlon Brando jacket. You will you will find this jacket. Like that's how I found it. So I'm gonna open up this bit right here, and it takes a go a good bit of effort to put this in. You just pop it right in. Like try, kind of try to maneuver it. So it goes in. Yeah. Try to maneuver it. Don't be afraid to bend the armor a little bit. All right, pause it. <laughs> All right. Now, what I did was I. Just give me a second here. Right here you go. Right, so we've got the back armor done. That's where you get it in. You open this up, as I showed. You squish these two sides of the armor together to put them into this top pocket. And when they're in that top pocket, you bend the parts in to fit in there perfect. Then you get the bottom area and fit it in. Now let's do. Let's do the elbow. I mean the shoulder. Sorry. What is this shit? There we go. So the shoulder will be literally underneath the armpit. So right here, and it goes in, and it goes in quite a bit. And the shoulders will be the small little padding now, they're not steel the padding it's very it's actually very hard so that will protect you if you fall off your bike all right let's put these in
very very much more easier than the last one that's probably the only problem with putting the armor in it is that the back is very hard to put on and there you go Sh your shoulders are protected if you ever fall off the bike there you go now i'm not going to put all right guys my camera stopped but i'm going to show you guys how to put the elbows in now because we did the shoulder shoulder we did the shoulder right now we're going to do the elbow the elbow is you zoom down there turn the flashlight you zoom like right here like maybe on the forearm you'll see this thing just like the others open it up grab one of your shoulder pads shoulder pads elbow pads just kind of stuff it in through there don't wait you probably get one like you got it yeah, you can stuff. You can put. All right, now, depending on how big your sleeve is, you can put it through your sleeve if you want. I usually put it through here. I don't know about anyone else, but I usually put it through the the arm, and then I grab it through the sleeve, and put it kind of. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, and then once that thing is open. Push it in. Well, I can't get it right now, but you guys know. You can get it in by like, opening that, squeezing it through, and um, the obviously the hole that it opens up with, and just kind of squish in the, kind of squish in the padding, kind of like, kind of like that, just to get it smaller, so you can get it into the, the hole it needs to get into, and then it'll be in there. And it will stretch out, and it, that will protect you. It's better. You're better off having armor in your jacket than not having armor in your jacket. You need armor if you're going to be on a bike. Like let's be honest, or else you're going to end up dying. And you know this. You you better not break your spine. You better have something to protect your spine, right? You, you need something to protect your spine. But anyway, other than the armor and the uh, other than the armor, like the, all the armor. This is an awesome jacket. This jacket was inspired by Marlon Brando back in like 1950-something. Like, this jacket has been allowed, been a lot. This jacket has been around way before I was even born. Way before my parents were born. Let's be honest here. Like, come on. Who wouldn't want this jacket? It's the most sexy jacket. Right, well anyway guys. I hope you enjoyed this review. Hope you enjoyed these videos. If you want more reviews, like I, I'm going to be doing like loads of pomade reviews, loads of gel reviews, all that shit. If you want more shit like that, or any like jacket reviews, clothes reviews, comment down below and leave a like on this video and subscribe.